Hi everyone. The latest project I'm working on is a high-yielding, low-cost, fully automated aeroponic system. I decided to make this aeroponic garden because I always loved growing veggies. A few years ago, a friend introduced me to hydroponics. With the support of my computer and electronic skill, which I gained over the past, I implemented a small system and the results were excellent compared to standard soil cultivation. Hydroponics is a method for growing soilless, where water is used as a medium for transferring nutrients to the plant. Aeroponics differs from hydroponic since roots are never submerged into the nutrient solution. A fine mist is sprayed to the roots. The amount of water entering into the grow chamber is controlled by a computer system. The main component of the system is the grow bank. A set of grow chambers, solenoid valves, a reservoir, a water pump, sensors and a customized computer system which is connected to a a server based on a Raspberry Pi compatible board. The server selected the watering program based on several search, searching criteria such as type and age of the vegetable, temperature, humidity and I'm currently working on in setting up a light intensity sensor. The system also prepares and dispatches the nutrient solution that best fit the growing veggie. Actually, this kind of system would be very difficult to control without software. Watering programs and the nature itself of the system requires a software support. In aeroponics and hydroponics, there are a lot of parameters that need to be set and checked. With the availability of sensors and the internet, these parameters may be chosen from the cloud and users' information may be shared in a worldwide database. Creating an environment uh, suitable for the plant's needs uh, produces healthy crop where the use of pesticide is not needed. Water consumption is also reduced and it produces consistent results, hence there is no need of high-level growing skills. With the help of professional growers and scientists, we'll be finalizing the system prototype and complete the software implementation of the core features. Next, we'll be designing each component and getting ready for production. In the future, I see more and more people and families growing their own vegetables without the use of pesticides or herbicides. 